You're probably wondering what the difference is between ADP and works. Well, let's find out. ADP is a large payroll company. They started way back in the 1970s in the Stone Ages, and so they've been around for a long time. Most all small businesses and large businesses alike know who ADP is. They're very well known for payroll processing. They have a huge number of clients. They actually write one in five of the world's paychecks, and so they have they are a dominant player in the market for payroll and HR services. They have a lot of additional ancillary services. You can buy 401k plans with them. You can buy health insurance with them, and really ADP is an awesome fit for larger employer employers like a FedEx in the world that need a lot of customization and need a lot of integrations. ADP is great for custom integrations, for adding on so several different solutions, and for customizing and super like getting something super tailored up for the larger employers of the world like FedEx and Amazon. Um, at Works, we're a little bit different. So we are a locally based uh, company in Memphis, Tennessee. We work really closely in our um, in our local M Memphis business community, and we work work very closely in a couple of verticals that we know extremely well. So there's a few uh, type of industries that we work super well with and so we handle multi-state payroll, um, but we work in those industries because we're very familiar over time with the compliance you face and the issues that you have across states and then across your specific industries. And so there's kind of two things that I think about when I think about ADP and works. And the first is really a customer service. At ADP, they're a huge company and so your customer support person is likely going to always change or be different. If they're a large company, they experience a lot more turnover than a company like ours. So if you go with ADP, you're going to get rock bottom pricing, uh, but sometimes that can be a bit of a challenge because you might also get rock bottom service. And on payroll day and you have a crisis, it's not ideal to be on hold for hours and hours. And so a lot of small businesses and even mid-sized businesses um, find some irritation with ADP because they may not be able to reach anybody that can handle their problem. If you just dial ADP's customer service line, it's probably going to take you five or six minutes just to get to somebody that knows your type of business. You're going to go through a call queue of are you a small business employer of one to 50 employees or 51 and above. Then they're going to ask you what state you're in. So some employers get really frustrated with that. However, if you can get past that and you are a larger employer, some of their more custom sets of just their ability to do specific things in the system and customize those things makes a lot of sense. Uh, that's a big factor for us, you know, it works. Like I said, we're a smaller team, so we do have dedicated support people for all of our clients. Uh, we don't experience a lot of turnover on our teams as well. Our longest customer rep as of today has been here for almost 10 years, 11 years. Probably should do some math there, I should know. Um, but has been with us for 10 years. And so when we say you're really gonna know someone and have a relationship, well, if you've been a client with us for 10 years, you could have had the same person handling your account. How old does somebody know you after 10 years? They're gonna know your business. And so we typically find that customer service is an area that we can support our business owners better in, simply because we have less clients and so we're able to service people a little bit better. Uh, the secondary big uh, difference between us, of course, is, is pricing. So you already know our model is based on a per employee per month fee. Uh, we do that PEP them rate based on the type of services that you need, and you're just charged a flat rate at the beginning of the month with your first payroll process. At ADP, you're always going to be charged a per payroll process. So if you're doing a weekly payroll or a bi-weekly payroll or a semi-monthly payroll, you're always going to see ADP's invoice uh, depending on your payroll cycle, whereas with us, you're going to see that fee at the beginning of the month just one time. Whether you run four payrolls, two payrolls, or six, your fee stays the same. So to compare, we think ADP is kind of like like the Walmarts of the world. Everyone knows who Walmart is. They're a huge company, they have dominant market share. You get rock bottom prices. Um, and we feel like we're more like a Trader Joe's. You know, you get to go in, pick your flowers, buy great wine. There's a lot that you can do at Trader Joe's, but it's a lot smaller. It's more locally sourced, custom organic, you know, food and products and great snacks. And so we feel we're kind of more like a, a custom, like a store you want to go to one or two times as opposed to those rock bottom prices. So in terms of being competitive with price, um, are we cheaper than ADP? typically no um, but like we said our promise to deliver you great customer service and help you get one step better every day uh, we believe ultimately is a better solution for your company in the long run than rock bottom prices at Walmart there's a time and place for Walmart you may be a Walmart customer you may be a Trader Joe's customer if you're a Trader Joe's kind of company give us a call at one at works and then you can also email us at one step better at works.com or check us out online you can book a demo or schedule a call with sales member directly thank you so much much.